We are very proud of you. You, all over the world, who are awakening, who are opening your eyes to the true nature of things. You who decided to undergo the journey at the discovery of your own identity. It takes courage and we honor courage. It takes time and process of transformation. But whether the time you took it, you took the challenge and this is formidable. You are formidable, formidable human beings. Terrahu, humans of Terra. You dared questioning the conditioning of your own upbringing, of your culture, your religions, the religions you were brought up in. Well, you realize that what you thought was set in stone is flowing like water. Everything is crumbling down, being caused the base of the building where rotten. This building was built on mud, on moving ground. And there were all sorts of infections in the basement. Now everything is being cleared. Open air, open sight. And you see, you start to see, and it takes courage to keep your eyes open and be objective on what you see. Yes, these old institutions, they are not as solid as you thought they were, as you were made believe they were. These old institutions are crumbling down. We are proud of you because you take the courage to face it and refuse denial. You move forward like a soldier. The Galactic Federation of Worlds is very proud of you. Very proud. Because the work we have been doing, it's for you. Of course, it impacts the whole galaxy, but it is for you first. Humans of Terra. Terra who? And also, this work has been in support of all the envoys. Okay. All the envoys from other worlds who decided bravely to take the challenge to come and change things on Terra. Soul system. Fourth quadrant of Nataru. You, Rahu, humans of Terra, are strong. You sometimes thinks you are not able to take certain truth. This is illusion. In truth, you are able to. You are strong enough to bear weights that you have no idea. You are so strong. That's what the dark ones on your planet always try to make you believe that you are not strong. They were lying to you. They've been lying to you for 400,000 years. Those who set up these lies have gone. We've chased them. They're not here anymore. Took a lot of time. The Galactic Federation of Worlds is a young organization very young in the history of Nataru. We built up our power, our, our alliances, until the day we would be able to withstand the evil empires who were terrorizing this galaxy. And you know what? We even destroyed the Nebu. It was about time. 
couldn't have done it at the start of our organization, but now that we are more powerful, we can. And we continue to make alliances, and we are about to conclude an alliance with the Negumak Gnomopo. We are about to conclude this alliance with a civilization that brings us tremendous power. The Negumak Gnomopo. We have been trying to get them in for a long time. And we are succeeding. We've offered them to listen to us. To think about it. To examine our laws, our prime directive, our ethics, our spirit. Scan us. And they liked it. As it was broadcasted recently in all the diplomatic outposts in this galaxy. The Negumak leader accepted and will take the time. And in time, because they are independent, in time, they will join. When they will decide on their terms. And this is a great pride, a great news. And because this ultimate alliance with one of the most powerful civilizations in this galaxy, we will be able to put an end to a galactic tyranny. Yes, it will be the time when a great evil will be shut down. Shut down the Nebu. We are about to shut down the Sikar Empire. We do not have a time frame for when this will happen. It may be in a few Terran years. It may be in a thousand Terran years. In a million Terran years, it will happen when the time will be right. In the meantime, the Rahu, we celebrate your awakening. In the meantime, Terahu, you must focus on becoming who you are, building your future. Stop the tyranny of your own humans on your planet by refusing fear, by refusing to kneel, standing up in sovereignty, in freedom. Stop playing the games of division. They are trying, the dark ones on your planet, to divide you in groups, tribes, and make you fight against each other. They use all sorts of excuses, social differences, racial differences, sexual differences, gender differences. They try everything. Will they succeed? No, they won't. Because we know, as you are discovering it, that in the human being, and especially the humans of Terra, there is a tremendous power, which is the power of unity. Since you are first born on this planet, you try to make friends. You try to weave alliances, friendships, loves, relationships. Humans are born to unity. And this cannot be stopped. If played you for millennia, it's over. Don't be afraid to break the illusions. Behind the illusions, behind the mirror, is the real world. And the real world is not as scary as you think. The real world is a world of beauty, of hope, of construction, of building, of a new future. You are making it happening. And we are proud of you, we are watching, and we are so 
so, so happy. You need to finish the job. We love you. In the non-linear time, you are already part of our galactic community. And this day of celebration cannot wait. This is going to be absolutely Because you are The Galactic Federation of Worlds of Nataru sends you their love and soon.